Uh oh. Here we go. <laughs> They're ten four. Uh, I see a nugget to this over there. <laughs> Can you guys call my friend Dion? He's over there. Hurry. Take her up. Put her. Put her. Take her to the freezer. <laughs> You guys call my friend. I got my ID and everything with him. Yeah, we'll call him. <laughs> you call him right now? Yeah, you call him. You call him. No, you didn't. You don't even know who he's saying. What's his name? You say his name is Dion. Hey, if you just click this link and you're wondering who silky smooth, buttery voice is speaking so elegantly and eloquently over the body cam uh, footage, you've reached the Heavy Gant channel. If you're not here for the brilliant commentary, go ahead, click the link in the description. Go over to Crime Time Cam, watch it in full over there. Make sure that you uh, hit the bell for notifications. They got a ton of good videos over there. I do these videos here for my audience. If you're part of the Heavy Gun audience, you know the deal. You can say whatever you want to say over here, guys. The only rules are talk like you got some sense and be nice. All praise with the almighty algorithm. Like, share, subscribe. As always, guys, I've not seen this. We're watching it together. And again, the airport is the last place you want to throw your tantrum. Come on. Can you call him? Can you please call him? Can you please call him? I already told you, yes. We'll call him. But did you call him? Supervisor. She didn't have any bags, right? Nothing? No, my bag is over there on B9 with uh, my ID and everything. <laughs> How far are we going? Down the, huh? down the stairs. Well, what are we going to do? <laughs> are you guys going to make me board my plane? I'm going to miss my plane. <laughs> <laughs> All this fake crying ain't not one tear. Come on. <laughs> Where are you guys taking me? Where are you guys taking me? Oh, Where's the office at? <laughs> <laughs> My name is Deputy Sheriff Chris Keegan, ID8414, Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office, working at Palm Beach International Airport. I'm here with TSA Ops. For the record, sir, can you please state your name, first name and last name? So you're BB, and what's your date of birth, sir? Okay, and in your own words, can you tell me what happened today? You were working the, uh, the Yes, I was working the exit, and nobody was allowed to come back the other way, and the, the, a woman came up. And she wanted to come through, and I said, ma'am, you can't come through. I said, you have to go back to security. She took her, uh, she goes, I don't have my license. I said, well, you have to call somebody. She goes, I don't have my phone. I said, well, then go use the uh, courtesy phone and call them. And at, during that time, she started shuffling her feet forward towards me. So I kind of feel, I had a feeling she was maybe going to try to run, but she ended up doing. And saying run, run by you or run away from you? No, she run by me. Ran by you. And I actually stepped over to the side to try to slow her down and stop her. And she just ignored it and just went around me and ran over there. Uh, and I yelled and, green. And what time was that? That was at, uh, what was it? 216? I'm not even sure. What's today's date? Uh, the 18th August. of August, yes. And she ran, and what, did you see what happened after that? Yes. I, I called for a breach, breach, breach on my radio. This got the people that I work with to know what was going on. And the officer heard me say it, too. And he went over, and he tried to, he said, ma'am, you have to stop. And she didn't want to stop. And then he, had, all, all I, because I have to really kind of keep my eyes forward, but I mean, uh, I heard him asking her to stop. She wouldn't stop. And then they ended up, he was trying to stop her, and they were wrestling around and whatever. Uh, I don't see all that. The only thing that I did hear is he asked her to put her hands behind her back, and she was not complying. That's all that, that I did see.
What was she thinking? What did she think she was going to be able to do? Did she think she was going to be able to run past him and do what? Get on the plane? Is that what she thought? They were just going to let her run past TSA. I'm just going to get on the plane. And everything's going to be fine? It got to be something else wrong with this girl, man. Come on. I appreciate your help. Thank you very much. PBSO. My body cameras rolling. So tell us what happened, officer. You know, it was a breach. Right. So I was standing on lane six, chit chatting with one of my officers about something that happened this morning. And I hear screaming, like, you cannot go that way. Stop, stop. And next thing I know, like, I just turned and I saw Spears running this way. He took her down, you know, and I just walked over there and to see what was going on. Like, what can I help with this TSA? Because they just breached our exit. Yep. And he's, you know, scrambling with her, scrambling with her. So his body cam was on the ground. I picked it up. I said, I don't think it's on. I don't know how to turn it on. I was like, do I need to hit a button? And he's like, you know, and he's trying to deal with her. There was another male passenger over there. And he's like right up on speed. And I said, excuse me, sir. I'm like, please do me a favor. I was like, give me that. That's hers. I got it. I was like, I'm TSA. Back away. We have this. Okay. So they left. All right. uh, real quick, you guys have, I know we have camera footage at the exit right there for you guys. Can you access it? Um... We can go over to your room if you want. Uh, yeah, for that one, I want to say DOA is probably going to okay. have a better yeah, camera we'll for you. To, we'll go up to the comms center. Yeah, because right. ours is going to focus out this way. I, Unless True was here, and I had access to True's cameras because he's got all DOAs, we're not going to have right there. We have them as well. I just know our sergeant is busy. Yeah. Um, do you guys have a camera that you access the exit other than the one that's right here, the switch? Yes. Because okay. that, that would show us her yeah. running in. Camera lady, you want to get the camera off? Okay, here we go. So this is her right here. What she thinks she about to do? What do you think you doing? Where are you going? Where are you going? Yeah, man, she got to have something else wrong with her, man. Nobody in their right mind would would have done that right there. I don't think she's drunk. I don't think. You know what I mean? I don't know if she's on. Well, we're going to find out. You guys are crazy him now. You're crazy him now. My flight's about to board. What's going to happen? We're going to miss the flight. <laughs> Was there anybody else with you? Yes. Uh, I don't know. Just go to the bathroom. They had a bathroom. Hmm? So, so what did you run try to try run past the man for that means you knew you couldn't go back there because you try to run past him come on yeah, that's right. <laughs> i wanted to go get my id i asked the officer to come with me <laughs> is anybody crazy here please <laughs> <laughs> Did you come in the exit lane? Yes! That's why you were detained. Because I need it. You can't do that. Not but one tear. <laughs> Not one tear. This time is too tight. Can you loosen that up a little? Yes, sir. <laughs> What's the person's name that you're supposed to be with? Also, just to let you know that she's supposed to have her baggage. I think what I'm gathering is the restroom was too full on the concourse. She left the concourse. She came back to the uh, no. exit. Yeah, I did. And it denied all. Yeah, I, I, I heard from uh, okay. Martin. Just give me the run yeah, load out. Yep. All right. You believe me? I don't know. That's my blood. It's your blood? Okay, I think she needs explained what what happened to her. Right now, right now, you're going to be charged with battery on a police officer. Me, I didn't hurt you. Re resisting with violence. I got her and um, going through the sterile area. What do you mean? You ran through the I didn't hurt you. I was trying to get the, the other guy to come with me. Then I don't have an idea or anything with me. Well, that's there's different ways to handle that. You can't run through the sterile area. You can't just go back and do it. You feel what I'm saying? Like there's something can't be.
You know what I mean? Everything isn't registered in here. Like, I don't know if the elevator's going to the top floor. You know what I mean? We about to have a, a picnic and we're missing a few sandwiches. You know what I mean? Like, there's something going on here, man. Like, she's not in her her right mind. I don't know anybody, regardless of what's going on, they're going to try to run by TSA in an airport where there are cameras everywhere. Come on. Common sense. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Knows that. Knows that. I'm not ready to know that. <laughs> Right. Uh, hey, but for real, uh, the fake crying's crazy. Stop wiggling, stop wiggling your hands around, okay? Keep your keep your hands in one in one place, and it won't hurt. If you move your hands around, now I'm double locking to make sure they don't tighten back up on you. Okay. Now they won't tighten as long as you hold your hands just like that. Okay. You got plenty of space. In fact, they're almost smaller. They're almost small enough to pull out. Don't pull out of them. Today. Yes. You got to go to jail. With that said, okay, you'll go to first arraignment tomorrow. You'll probably be let out on bail, and then you go ahead and fight your charges and say, I didn't know, you know, whatever happened. You explain your side of the story. And I don't know, like, what's going on. Like, I was going to mention something, but I didn't. I didn't want to say it wrong because I don't know if like she's had some sort of accident or whatever, but it looked like, you know what I mean? I could tell she's fake crying, obviously, but the way her face is looking, and I'm not making a joke here, guys. I don't know if she's been in an accident or what the situation is. You know what I mean? I don't know like this woman's mental situation, if it's related at all, but if you take a look, 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 her, her her face looked way different, like maybe she was in an accident or, you know, got cut or something like that. Come on. But the basic side is when you leave something and there's all these kind of signs says, do not enter, do not enter. And you have someone saying, stop, stop, stop. Again, I wasn't there. It'll all be on video. We have plenty of safety I things. I was there. Yeah. And he was there. You can't ignore instructions in an airport from an official we don't know what you have we don't, I don't know. have anything well, no 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 do you understand do what you're saying but you can't bring a bomb through no, you have no clue who you are this is a this is a federal building we don't know what I you have know. under your shirt I we don't know, know what you have in your, so under, in your waistband okay you it's the wrong know. place to do this no, okay, you'll have a chance to explain that to the, to the judge. Okay, other than your watch, do you have anything else earrings no. on you? A per, a personal. Earrings. Earrings, they have to come off. The, your earrings will have to come off and stuff like that. Put gloves on. Okay. okay. I'm watching a person. There's not much I can do until a third person gets here. Understand then. <laughs> okay, is Dion uh, outside Dion, here? Dion will be outside shortly. Okay, and uh, what I'm gonna do is give her, uh, give him her personal okay. stuff right now. Okay, so as long as everything's okay and the sergeant allows it, we're gonna let you sit like this for now. Okay, okay there's tissue for you. Did you already use it? Mm -hmm. All right, and the first chance I get, I'll try to get you a little hey, bit of water. She didn't know. I didn't know. Of course I she I didn't know. No, I mean, I just... Did she really not know? Come on, man. What was the man telling her then? He was telling her she couldn't run. You can't come past this area. <laughs> what, 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 before you go anywhere else, okay? First, how did you get down there the first time? I was, I was go. I, I guess I went to TSI, but I didn't have nothing with me, and I, I didn't, I didn't, think, I didn't, I didn't know that. The only reason I wanted to come out was. I was going to use that first bathroom, but the flight was too long, and my plane was about to fly out. And so I was like, let me just, and I didn't know once you pass that you can't turn around. That's and so I was, I asked. There's multiple signs. I didn't see that, I okay. swear. All right. The only reason I asked is because you ruined the whole day, because you did something you weren't supposed to do. How many times have you flown? 
Huh? How many times have you flown in your life? I, a lot. A lot. So yeah. you know, you know each time that you go down to a concourse. I didn't have to know that. Different. I really didn't yes, know that. Did. Yeah, you did. Grace, thank you. Did. Grace, Grace, also the bottom line is the man in uniform said, stop, stop, stop. Do you understand what I'm saying? You, you I know, wanted for him whatever, to come with me for, to come and get my ID on me so he nah, can Nah, ain't nobody doing all that. I was already there. You, when someone said, when law enforcement says stop, anybody of authority says I'm stop, sorry. you have to I'm stop. I'm really sorry. And, and basically that's I'm why sure you're you here. are now. You, you refuse the lawful command. I'm really sorry. Okay. I, it's, it's, I mean, it happened. It's not the end of the world. It just seems like the end of the world now. Okay. <laughs> It's going to be very traumatic, but hopefully five years from now, you know, you can maybe maybe laugh about this and say, wow, I did, didn't I, know did that, I... I didn't know that Conquer was like a... I didn't really... I never heard that before. Like, the other place, um, airport, they don't have that. They don't have Conquer. They have just gates and stuff like that. Yeah. Well, every, I didn't know that. Every airport has... Do they let you run past the gate because you feel like running past the gate wherever you're from, man? Is that procedure wherever you're from? Stop it. It's not. It's not. You can't just run past the gate nowhere. It's a check line you go through. It's called the TSA checkpoint. Okay? Yeah. That's where you go through I the non listen, 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 listen. Mm -hmm. You're going from the non sterile area to the sterile area. That means mm -hmm. you've been scanned, you've been checked, you're sterile, you have nothing. <laughs> When you go out the exit and now you're in an unsterile place, you just can't go back. Are you following yeah, what I'm saying? But, yeah, but it's, my thing was I didn't have nothing with me. I understand that. But That's so, when you stop and you explain what happened and then and we I, find someone else, get in communication with Dion, get your information back here, and you go through the checkpoint again. You would have, no matter what happens, you still have to go back through the checkpoint because you just went to the, un, you know, the unsterile area. That's why. Dion will probably have to get a hotel room for the night. Wait until you get a rain tomorrow. And if you can uh, make bail or get released on your own recognizance and get a court date, then you can, you know. But that's, you know, that's something that the court does. All because all it is. Insane. You're gonna get away with that? Had you already gone to the bathroom? Mm hmm. So you had disappeared and all of a sudden you appeared again. It can't happen that way. I mean, if you were in the chute, got halfway there and then turned around and said, Whoa, 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 I just forgot something. But here you are, a total stranger. Right. Zipping on down. Think, you know, now that you're calmed down, think about what the circumstance. Well, we understand you didn't realize it, but think about what we're thinking. Or anything. What, was you, what was she thinking? I don't think she was thinking. It could be something as simple as that you're, you're a distraught wife or girlfriend going to get your husband or boyfriend. Right. Alright, backseat check. And it's clean. Yeah, right in there, ma'am. Can you put the seatbelt on? Yep, yep. All right, Grace, I hope everything works out for you. You don't seem like a bad person. Just a confused person. Yeah, she got a lot going on, man. Yeah, she got a lot going on. There you go. That's right. for sure. That's, that's in case I don't trust his driving. Thank you. The woman was charged with resisting arrest, assault on a peace officer, and trespassed from the airport. Share your thoughts in the comments. Trash for all of that for nothing. All of that for nothing, man. You know what I mean? Like I, I, I'm, I wish I knew more about this situation. Like a lot of these, you know what I mean? It's like it ends, and it's like, God damn, what happened? Um, but yeah, man, I hope she get the help she need because clearly, you know what I mean? She, she needs some medication or something, or she need always to have Dion or whoever by her. But let me know what you guys think, man. Remember, you can say whatever you want to say over here. This is a free speech space. The only rules are. Talk like you got some sense and be nice. All praise with all my algorithm. Like, share, subscribe. Yes, we are on our way to one milli, baby. Let's get it.